Are you using Gemini 3 Pro just like a normal Google search? If you are, you are doing it wrong. Most people don't see the features that make this tool truly strong. I have tested Gemini 3 Pro for a while and I discovered seven amazing features. These are hidden inside the menu and most users have no idea they exist. In this video, I will show you all seven secrets so you can finally use the full power of this AI model. Let's start with feature number one. It is called the Storybook Gem. You can find it right here in the sidebar. Honestly, this is the most useful tool that nobody talks about. Many people see the name Storybook and ignore it. They think, oh, that is just for creative writing or for children, but they are wrong. It is actually a powerful way to see and understand difficult information. Let me show you how it works. Click on the Storybook button to open it. Imagine you have a long, boring 32-page document. Maybe it's a history of computer or a technical manual. I uploaded the file here. Then I type, make this into a storybook with key chapters. Describe the picture for each scene. Now, watch this. It takes that long, hard text and breaks it into simple sections. Each section gets a picture description and a short summary. It basically turns a boring document into a visual slideshow that is very easy to read. You can use this for video ideas, study notes, or just to make reading fun. Next, I want to highlight the second feature. It is actually the one I use the most. It is the built-in YouTube tool for Gemini 3 Pro. I am taking a link to a video about quantum computing. The video duration is about 1 hour and 36 minutes. I copy the video link and paste it here. Next, I give it a specific instruction. I ask Gemini to watch this video scene by scene and summarize it for me. Watch what happens. It processes the video structure, not just the words. The result is amazing. Gemini sorts the information perfectly. You can see how Gemini turns a 90-minute deep dive into a structured roadmap. It doesn't just transcribe, it understands the logic. From the math basics at the start to complex algorithms like Shores at the end, it gives you exact timestamps for every key concept. Instead of scrubbing through a long video, you now have an interactive index that lets you jump straight to what matters. It's like having a personal teaching assistant who's already watched the lecture and organized the notes for you. If you love saving time and want to get quick summaries of long videos just like I do, hit the like button right now. This helps YouTube show this trick to more people. This brings us to feature number three, workspace extensions. Believe it or not, 90% of people don't even know this exists. This feature lets Gemini leave the chat box and actually look at your personal files. Here is how you turn it on. Go to the bottom left corner, click on settings, then choose apps. Just make sure Google Workspace is switched on. Now, let's try it out. By simply typing the at symbol, you can now connect directly to your Google Workspace apps. Watch this. I'm tagging at Gmail and asking it to find urgent emails and summarize long threads. Instead of scrolling for hours, Gemini instantly pulls the critical stuff, like AdSense payments and policy warnings, right into the chat. Now, let's take action. I need to book a meeting. I tag at Google Calendar, give it the date and time for a meeting with John in 2025, and boom, it's scheduled right there in the interface. We check the actual calendar app, and it's perfectly synced. This is the future of multitasking. Be honest, how many of you knew before this moment that you can connect Gemini directly to your Google Calendar and Gmail? Write in the comments for me. I knew, or I didn't know. Feature number four is to build your ideas. And this is the one that completely changes the game. Until now, we've been using AI to generate content like text, images, and videos. This feature uses AI to generate software. In AI Studio, look for the section called Build. You can find that in the left sidebar. Click that. You'll see a simple text field that describes your idea. Now you can describe a tool, a dashboard, or a web app in plain English and Jim and I will actually write the code and build the interface for you in real time. Let me show you. I'm going to ask it to build something that would usually take a developer a few hours to code from scratch. I'm typing to build a single HTML file for a responsive crypto portfolio tracker with a modern dark theme. Users should be able to add assets and see a live dashboard with total value and profit loss. Use chart.js for visuals and simulate live market data updates with random numbers instead of an API. And boom, look at this dashboard. Gemini just gave me a working tool from scratch. 
We've got total net worth, live performance percentages, and a beautiful real-time growth chart. Let's test it. I'm adding a custom asset. Let's buy some dog coin. The chart updates instantly. The pie chart shifts and look at the AI strategist card. It actually analyzes the risk of my meme coins. That is insane. And the final test, responsiveness. The desktop looks clean. Switching to mobile view, the layout stacks perfectly. This entire app took minutes to generate. This is the future of coding. This feature really changes everything. If you don't want to fall behind in the world of AI and want to learn how to build your own tools, make sure to subscribe to the channel. In the next videos, we are going to build even more complex projects together. Let's move on to feature number five, the deep research tool. This is the main reason Gemini is leading the AI market right now. Let me show you why. First, go to Google Gemini. Click on the Tools button here and choose Deep Research. You will see the screen change a little bit. Now, I'm going to give it a list of 60 different cars. For each car, I want to extract the engine code, oil type and capacity, gearbox oil, and brake fluid. I want all this information organized into a clean table. This will give us a large table with 60 rows and five columns. Now I will type this prompt. Using official service manuals, create a technical data table for the vehicles.txt that is attached. For each, include the engine code and the specific type, grade, approval standard, and total capacity for engine oil, transmission fluid, brake fluid. Then I hit generate. Gemini immediately makes a plan. I can change it, but it looks good, so I click Start Research. Now it is working. This takes about two to three minutes because I am reading many websites and checking facts right now. And look at the result. It created a complete technical table. It found the specific engine code for each vehicle. It also listed the exact type and capacity for engine oil, transmission fluid, and brake fluid. Also, every fact has a link so I can verify it. If I did this alone, it would take me three or four hours to search Google, read vehicle manuals, and take notes. Deep Research did it all in just three minutes. This is amazing for research and finding. It is perfect when you need clear facts from many sources, fast. Okay, for feature number six, we need to leave the normal Gemini website. We are going to a special place called Google AI Studio. This is like a playground for developers, and it gives you access to the powerful Gemini 3 Pro model. But the best part? The audio generation here is amazing. Click right here to open the text-to-speech tool. Let's start with a single speaker. I will just paste my text here. For the style, I want to read aloud like a professional YouTuber and hit run. Listen to this result. Hello, everyone. Welcome to my AI for Next YouTube channel. Wow, that does not sound like a robot. You can hear the small pauses and the breathing. It sounds like a real person in the studio. But wait. It gets even better. Let's switch to multi-speaker mode. In the voice settings section, you can give each speaker a name and pick a voice from the list. You can also edit the text that each speaker will say. To add more to the conversation, just click Add Dialog. This opens a new box for the next speaker. For example, I will paste two texts here for speaker one and speaker two. On the left side of the page, you can see all the text that will be read. Every sentence you add appears here. If I delete the text for speaker one and speaker two, you'll see it disappears. If I paste it back, it returns instantly. Now, I have copied a conversation between Jim and Mary. When I paste it, an orange warning box appears at the top. This means the system doesn't know who is speaking. To fix this, just change the names in the voice settings box on the bottom right. See that? As soon as I type Mary, the system finds her lines. I will do the same for Jim and choose a good voice for both. Now, I'm hitting the run. It's processing the text, assigning the voices, and generating the audio waveform. And we are done. Let's listen to the final result. Babe, I finally figured out women. Oh, really? Spill it, genius. Y'all just want someone who listens and also carries all the groceries and kills spiders and remembers anniversaries and... So, basically, a boyfriend, a pack mule, an exterminator, Google Calendar, and a goldfish with better memory. Ah, uh, I'm starting to think I'm the one who needs a raise. This is much better than just reading a wall of text. You can use this to check your own writing for mistakes, or you can turn long articles into audio and listen to them on your way to work. Honestly, the options are endless. And finally, feature number seven, video generation with the new VEO 3.1 model. This is a huge update. Google has finally put their best video tool directly into the main Gemini chat. Here is how you use it. In the chat, just click the tools icon at the bottom, select create videos, and you are ready. Now, the prompt or your instruction 
is very important. I want a video I can actually use for work, so I am typing this. Create a looping video of a futuristic gaming desk. Features include a mechanical keyboard with pulsing RGB lights, a translucent holographic display, and a can of energy drink. Motion, a slow breathing light effect on the keyboard and floating data particles on the hologram. Use cool neon blue and violet lighting. I want this for the top section of a website. I hit generate. Now we wait. This takes about 60 to 90 seconds. It might feel a bit slow, but remember, the AI is not searching for a video. It is creating every pixel from scratch. It is calculating the light and the reflections right now. And here is the result. Look at that quality. The camera moves smoothly. The lighting on the can and keyboard looks real with depth. The rotating hologram ensures a perfect seamless loop. You can use this for website backgrounds to make them look alive. It is also great for social media ads because videos get more attention than simple photos. So now you know exactly how to use Gemini 3 Pro to its full potential. And this changes the dynamic completely. You aren't just using AI to answer questions anymore. You are using it to build research agents, generate software, and automate your entire workflow. If you want to stay ahead of the AI curve, subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon so you never miss a new model release or major feature update. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.